leveled up, I thank God. Scrape from the mud, now it's time to get the pie. Sweat in my eyes. My future's turning up, what it's time to be a. So, last night, I saw a trailer for a new movie coming out around August, and it's called Trap. And it's from the director and writer of some of my actual favorite films, uh, specifically when he does these creepy style films, M. Night Shyamalan. I believe that's how you say his last name. And I, if I said it wrong, I said it wrong. But this film, or at least this trailer, was very, very interesting. Now... If you haven't seen the trailer, click away from this video. Go watch the trailer. Come back because boy, oh boy, is this trailer very, very intriguing. Now, at first, when I saw this trailer, I was like, oh, my God, this is going to be another one of those kidnap type of film. I guess you could say a kidnap type of film where the kid gets kidnapped and the dad goes out of his way. Now, I should have known, I should have known, but for some reason, I forgot. I was like, yeah, no, this is just some regular ass film, right? When you see this trailer and you notice what's going on, I was so surprised. Now, I saw some people say, well, you already spoiled the film. We, we know what's going to happen, but that's not the point of the film. The point of the film is not to get you with the, oh, he's the killer. No, that's not the point of the film. The point of this experience of this film is we're going to be watching what this killer does to get away from this trap. How would he succeed to get away from this trap? That's what they're doing. That is the experience we're going to see in this film. It's not the reveal of, oh, he's the killer. So now the movie is spoiled. No, that is the hook. That is what they grabbing you with. That is what they're using to grab your attention is that this is something you've never seen before. This is going to be an experiment of what will he do? What what is he willing to do? to get away from being caught by the police and boy oh boy from what i can see and from what how crazy he looks like he's gonna get he's gonna do everything in his power to make sure he makes it out of there without being caught and from the looks of it also looks like this man is somewhat connected to an FBI or something like that because uh, if you pay close attention there is one shot where he gets on home secure uh, the home security base uh, like an app so he's able to see stuff and yeah I think that experiment we're gonna see is just what he's willing to do to get away with it now there is a little bit of me that is thinking, could he be pulling our rug? Could this guy maybe not even be the killer, but he's just someone that's really interested in this character, in this serial killer called the Butcher? I don't know. I don't know, but I am so down to go watch this film day one. I don't need no more trailers, M. Night. You got my money. I'm down for day one, and I'm, I'll am i probably be, if, it, if the film's so freaking good, I'm going to do a review, and then if the film's so fucking good, I'm going to buy the 4K, and I'm going to be watching this type of film, because I love films like this, I love when they they give you a, they, um, they trick you, pretty much, he did it with Sixth Sense, he did it with the old, uh, he did it with the visit, um, I'm trying to think what he did it with split unbreakable glass. I, I'm so down, man. I am so down. I love what this guy does. Um, he's had some incredible hits and he's had some incredible flops. 
But man, when he gets it, he gets it. And this film looks like it's going to be freaking phenomenal. Let me know what you guys think down below. Have you guys seen the trailer? What are your thoughts of the trailer? Are you excited for this film? I'm very excited. I'm there day one. I don't need nothing else. I don't need nothing else. I don't need another trailer, nothing. But let me know what you guys think. And if you guys enjoy this video, make sure to leave a like, make sure to subscribe, share the video, and I'll catch you guys on the next one. I just leveled up, I thank God.